I knew how to make money off my music. I knew how to um, cultivate relationships or how to just maintain certain important relationships in the industry. I knew how to make music um, that would be relatable, but also be something that pushes the boundary or the envelope a bit. You know, I mean, I've learned um, so much from from just being around. You know, and I'm still learning. You know, quite by the over and that, you should never be at a point where you know everything. You wait up for the full yenga kwe, wait up for the full yenga sambira. Should never be too wise to learn. You know, be wise but still teach a boy. Should be their style. Um. So yeah, even um, from a situation like this, the things that I've learned about it, even if it's not like the first time something like this has happened, um, I still find a way of thinking, mm, what can I learn from a situation like this? You know, that sort of thing. What um, about you, Valandati? Wamutu Guru Sale Wankonyo. You know? Things like this will happen, you know. What I mean, no matter how patient you are with people, no matter how aware you are, there will be times when you just snap. I won't dive into what happened at what late to that. Just know that at this particular point in my career, why do you think from nowhere I would do something like that? There's a whole explanation, but I don't want to go a lot of back and forth, back and no, he did this, no, he did, you know, that sort of thing. Fiance Fidel, I think it's, um, it's irrelevant to the story. I just feel um, a lot of public figures, a lot of uh, famous people are bullied on social media every single day. Every single day. And... Um, People will poke you every single day. They will tell you anything just to get a response from you or a reaction from you. And when you poke back, uh -uh, you are the problem. How could you do something like that? You are a celebrity. You need to lead by example. That's why a lot of celebrities, whether it's locally or, or, or internationally, go through a lot of depression and trauma and all sorts of mental illnesses because of that. You are not... Um, allowed to express yourself you just swallow your pride and uh, just be happy we are the fans we made you you know what I mean um, so yeah um, I personally understand that with great power comes great responsibility and I have a responsibility to uh, lead by example or to act a certain way, especially in public. Um, but I also understand that every person's got a limit to to what they can tolerate. But they are going to snap or act out of character. Why should I dare so? Um, our job is basically like a, like a receptionist's job. Every time you step out of the house, you know you are not entitled to your privacy anymore. You need to uh, be welcoming and you need to smile at people and try and be as accommodative as possible. Uh, personally, for me, I always have to remind myself that I'd rather be an artist who people make a fuss about or who people want to talk to or take a picture with than an artist who people look at and be like... Uh, you know that sort of thing so every single uh, every now and then I remind myself of how how amazing this position I'm in where um, people even want to take a picture of me or talk to me about you know stuff so when it gets to a point like that like I said where I have to then you know there's something that warranted it and um, again, um, on social media, sometimes what happens is people watch like a small snippet of the video and and 
and draw their conclusion from from that they don't understand the whole the whole story and sometimes it's 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 not even wise to just to tell the whole story chimomuntu ile akobat akobat ah you wait of the bamba lolo e wa fula wa mboku mulangisha ni fwala you know what i mean lolo am kwa abantu ati ule ta fwele bamba lolo mba wa mboku pita mole balangisha abantu ati ni fwala mone you know that sort of thing so even something like this is is just it's just sad that in the news like this will travel faster and will trained more than than if i did something amazing you know that sort of thing um even that same gig um if you watch the whole video or if you were there you would understand that ama abantu abati kuri abali benafe aba kuchingola kuri afi aba hf3 quarters if you are at the gig you'd know fe that there's a lot of like there was so much confusion that if you are an artist who's going to perform there once you know that hey guys we need security don't allow anyone on stage don't do a b c d or but even when you do that there's always going to be confusion um but anyway um all in all um i don't even want to justify any of that stuff um i think um on my end um i should uh exhibit more restraint you know what i mean i should have a little more control even when i feel like uh there are certain things that should not happen uh and uh it's frustrating and whatever i think uh certain things can be handled um better so um again uh this is not necessarily me justifying anything or or defense um it's actually me coming to you uh my fans and nation at large people who felt like i'm a little disappointed by his conduct you know what i mean um i'm really sorry i disappointed you um but you should understand that no one is completely perfect you know what i mean all of us uh will make mistakes and will be fed up and will act out of character or will do some um stuff um and my whole career i've tried not to come out as perfect when people put you on a pedestal it's easy for you to disappoint them you know what i mean i i i'm going to make a lot of mistakes even in the future i'm going to make a lot of them i am far from perfect but every single day i try and just see how i can be the best version of myself um so yeah thank you so much for the love really appreciate it bless